first, we want to get you caught up on the stories making news this week. Motorists in Coon Rapids must now prepay for their gasoline at all gas stations in the city. The new prepay ordinance took effect on August 1st and makes Coon Rapids the first city in the state to adopt such a law. CTN Steve Antis has reaction. Would you like it filled up today, ladies? On day one of the prepay gas ordinance, Jerry Shermoli offered his customers at Highway 10 Mobile old-fashioned service, the kind your grandmother used to get. They started that prepay ordinance today. Yep, yep. So we're going to pump the gas for the girls with class. Charmoli offered his customers a loyalty card program. It's the exception to the prepay ordinance. It would allow a customer to activate a fuel pump before paying. They can put it in the pump, activate it. We know it's one of our loyalty members. They can pump the gas and come in and pay for it. Over 20 retail fuel operators in Coon Rapids are following the new ordinance, but not everyone is happy about it. Still, there are others who are warming up to the idea, like Betty. I was thinking it's a little bit inconvenient. Betty told us she always pays for gas with cash. I guess for the sake of no runoffs and drive-offs, I can understand that. One in five of our thefts in Coon Rapids was the theft of gasoline. Police Chief Brad Wise pushed for the ordinance after nearly 500 drive-off thefts were reported in each of the last two years. That kind of volume of theft impacts the reputation of the city of Coon Rapids. Um, it impacts our quality of life, our sense of safety. Ultimately, property values are impacted by these things. Prepay gas ordinances have already popped up in a handful of cities around the country. Furthermore, Chief Wise says this ordinance puts the responsibility for gas theft on each business to solve the problem. We expect compliance and then we'll do checks at various times. In Coon Rapids, Steve Antis, CTN News. Now the Coon Rapids Police Department will conduct those compliance checks at gas stations similar to what they do for alcohol and tobacco sales. A violation of the prepay ordinance is considered a misdemeanor.